We've got typical British weather here at Stowe Hill today. It starts off very windy um, and then it's brightened up now actually. Here comes White Atlas. She's a 58 foot reverse layout cruiser built in 2012 on a Colcraft shell and fitted out by Boatyard Boat Fitting. She was last blacked in spring 2020. Six anodes fitted on her, they were deemed satisfactory at the blacking. Um, and the engine was last serviced in autumn 2021, but that's only done approximately 35 cruising hours since due to COVID and that. The solar panels on the roof, there's 300 watts of solar. They keep the batteries topped up nicely. It's also those two roof, bo roof boxes for additional storage. Side hatch air overlooking the dinette. We'll get a closer look at that. The pram and cratch covers are both in very good condition. They've both got these roll-up flaps to allow light in. There is also a cover very similar for the side hatch. The stern deck is 7 foot 10, plenty of room for passengers. Got all your mooring equipment visible there. There's gas in either of these either side lockers. They're both 13 kilos. And then you've got the view from the helm. This, cratch, this uh, pram cover does all fold down, obviously, for cruising. And then in we go. Galley's first. It's quite big at 9 foot 6. It's got a laminate worktop with the solid oak edge. The fit out in here is oak faced ply with solid oak trim throughout with oak flooring as well. It's in excellently fitted out. At the rear here, in this cupboard you've got the microwave and a little bit of storage. There is storage under the top two of these steps as well. Um, in here you've got the Master Vault 2.5 kilowatt mass combi inverter charger. The other two steps and the bottom part contain the pump out tank which because it's not under the bed gives you plenty more storage back there which you'll see later. Drawer and cupboard here. fighting the sunshine now, trying to get you the, the best views without the sun getting in the way. Nice big cupboard. And another little drawer. Stainless steel sink. There is a inline water filter for that tap as well. Got the Thetford oven, grill and four burner gas hob. As you can see, it's exceptionally clean. They've, they've been cleaning it all week. It is in immaculate condition. Um, Bumble's currently on holiday, which is why he's not in the video, but I'm not sure we'd be letting him on anyway because it is in such nice condition. One of your demountable tables there, a larger one. That's the side hatch. And there's the dinette. So you've got two different sized demountable tables. That also converts into a spare double when needed. Plenty of light and fresh air from that side hatch. There's storage underneath the dinette as well. And there's also a very cleverly hidden safe. The saloon is 10 foot 4. There's these two leathers, leather captain chairs with the matching footstools. And there is an obelisk multi-fuel stove. Again, that's been cleaned to perfection. 19-inch TV, separate DVD player and cupboard underneath. The bottom part of that cupboard also lifts off so you can have some uh, a little bit more hidden storage in there. And that's a look back down the saloon. Head height is 6 foot 4 and the lights are LED throughout. Bathroom is next. Bathroom is compact at five feet, but it's got everything that you need. Square shower tray there with the folding shower door. It's a Tecma macerator pump out loo. Got the basin there with a little cupboard below that. So as I said, you've got everything you need in the bathroom. So the space has been used elsewhere. Bedroom at the front of the boat, that's 11 foot 7. Got these cupboards here, nice big cupboard, shelved cupboard there. And beneath that, in this cupboard, you've got the Candy Elise washer dryer. The hot water for that is off the engine, so it's a lot more power efficient than uh, some. As I said, loads of storage space under the bed. 
You could easily convert that into drawers if you wanted to, um, but it's a nice open space for now. And then the single full height wardrobe at the end. The bed is a six foot three by four foot two fixed double. And then you've got the cratch. The cratch is four feet, got these lockers either side with padded cushions. Tins of paint and bits and pieces there that you might need to touch things up if you need to. Because the gas is at the back, you've got storage in that forward bow locker as well. And looking back through, it's a nice little feature there. They've had the, the name of the boat engraved in that panel. There is an integral water tank under the well deck. We're not sure of the capacity. There's a Wabasto Thermo Top C diesel fired system connected to three radiators. That heats the hot water as well as the engine and there's also an immersion. All of the windows are double glazed. They are excellent at keeping the heat in. It's very, very efficient. It's double lined polystyrene insulation. So altogether, um, good heat retention. Underneath the stern deck here, you've got the Beta 43 engine with PRM 150 gearbox. That is squeaky clean. You really could eat your dinner off of that. And the bank of 410 amp hour domestics and 190 amp hour starter. The starter was new this month, so that's actually got a 12 month warranty on it. And there we are. That's White Atlas for a fully downloadable colour brochure photos and the full spec visit our website at rugbyboats.co.uk